Today, I'm going to show you how Google's AI mode just killed traditional SEO. This isn't some small update. This is the biggest change to search in 25 years. And if you don't adapt right now, your website traffic is about to disappear. I'm talking about real drops happening right now. But here's the crazy part. Some sites are actually getting more traffic from this change. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below. Look, I've been doing SEO for over 15 years. I've built a seven-figure agency with 50 people. I've written two best-selling books on SEO. And I can tell you right now, everything we knew about SEO just changed. Google's AI mode is rolling out everywhere. And most SEO experts are still scratching their heads, trying to figure out what happened. But I've been studying this for months now. And what I found is going to shock you. First, let me show you the real data that nobody's talking about. AI mode rolled out to everyone in the US in May 2025 and it already has over 100 million monthly active users. That's explosive growth in just two months. But here's what's really happening. Nearly 60% of Google searches in 2024 ended without a click. That's right. Almost six out of 10 people get their answer from Google and never visit a single website. And with AI mode, searches are now two to three times longer than traditional Google searches, sometimes even five times longer. People are having full conversations with Google instead of just typing keywords. Here's the scary part for website owners. AI mode uses multiple searches behind the scenes to generate one comprehensive answer. It runs searches for related questions to give users everything they need without clicking on your site. Let me put this in perspective. If you were getting 1000 clicks per month from the number one position last year, you're probably getting around 350 clicks now. That's not a small dip, that's a business killing drop. But here's where it gets interesting because while most sites are losing traffic, some sites are actually winning big from this change. The sites that are winning have figured out something that 99% of SEO experts haven't caught onto yet. And I'm going to tell you exactly what it is. You see, AI mode doesn't just kill traditional SEO. It creates a completely new way to get traffic. AI mode is like having a conversation with Google. You can ask complex questions and follow up with more questions. It's not just showing you links anymore. It's giving you comprehensive answers. And here's the crazy part. AI mode uses what Google calls query fan out technique. It breaks down your question into subtopics and runs multiple searches at the same time. This lets Google dive deeper into the web than ever before. So how do you tap into this? How do you get your content featured in AI mode? This is where most SEO experts are getting it completely wrong. They're still thinking about keywords and backlinks and all that old school stuff. But AI mode works completely differently. Google's AI doesn't care about your keyword density. It doesn't care how many backlinks you have. It cares about three things, expertise, precision and sources. Let me break this down for you. First, expertise. The AI prioritizes content from recognized experts in their field. If you're writing about marketing, you better have credentials. If you're writing about health, you better be a doctor. The days of random bloggers ranking for everything are over. Second, precision. The AI loves specific detailed information. Vague, fluffy content gets ignored. You need exact numbers, specific case studies, precise methodologies. The more detailed and specific you are, the more likely the AI will cite you. Third, sources. The AI wants to see your work. Where did you get your information? What studies are you referencing? What data are you using? If you don't cite your sources, the AI won't cite you. This is why a small specialized blog with detailed case studies can now outrank major media sites. Raw traffic volume doesn't matter anymore. Citation quality is everything. Google isn't just adding AI to search. They're completely rebuilding search from the ground up. Traditional search was about matching keywords to pages. AI mode is completely different. It's a conversational experience where you can ask follow-up questions and get comprehensive answers. AI mode builds on AI overviews, but takes it much further. While AI overviews just show you a summary at the top of search results, AI mode is a full conversational interface. You can ask complex questions, get detailed answers, and keep asking follow-ups. This means the whole concept of ranking number one is becoming obsolete. Instead of one winner taking all the traffic, AI mode pulls information from multiple sources and combines them uh, into one answer. So your goal isn't to rank number one anymore. Your goal is to become one of the trusted sources that AI relies on to build its answers. And here's how you do it. Number one, become the go-to expert in your niche. This isn't about being the biggest site. It's about being the most trusted. Start publishing original research, share unique case studies, interview industry experts, build real expertise, not just content. Number two, 
Structure your content for AI consumption. AI models love structured data, use clear headings, break information into logical sections, include specific numbers and statistics. Make it easy for AI to extract key information from your content. Number three, cite everything. Every claim you make needs a source. Every statistic needs a reference. Every quote needs attribution. The more you cite others, the more others will cite you. Number four, focus on depth over breadth. Don't try to cover everything. Pick a narrow niche and go incredibly deep. A 5,000 word comprehensive guide on a specific topic will be 10 generic 500 word articles every time. Number five, optimize for featured snippets and answer boxes. These are the building blocks of AI mode. If you can't get featured snippets, you won't get AI citations, but here's what most people miss. The AI doesn't just look at your content, it looks at your entire digital footprint, your social media presence, your industry recognition, your thought leadership, everything matters now. This is why personal branding is becoming so important in SEO. The AI wants to cite real people, not faceless websites. If you're not building your personal brand alongside your content, you're missing out on a huge opportunity. Now let me tell you about the types of content that are winning in AI mode. How-to guides are performing incredibly well, but not just any how-to guides, step-by-step -step tutorials with specific instructions, screenshots, and measurable outcomes. The AI loves actionable content. Comparison articles are also crushing it, but again, not generic comparisons, detailed analyses with pros and cons, specific use cases, and clear recommendations. The AI wants to help users make decisions, so decision-focused content performs well, Data-driven articles are absolute gold. Original surveys, industry reports, statistical analyses, anything with unique data that can't be found elsewhere. The AI craves fresh information. Case studies are another winner. Real examples with specific results, detailed methodologies, and lessons learned. The AI loves concrete examples it can reference. But here's what's not working anymore. Generic blog posts, keyword stuffed articles, thin content, duplicate information. The AI ignores all of this because it doesn't add value. And here's something that might surprise you. Long form content isn't automatically better anymore. The AI cares about comprehensiveness, not length. A 2000 word article that thoroughly covers a topic will beat a 5000 word article that's full of fluff. Now let's talk about the technical side of optimizing for AI mode. Schema markup is more important than ever. The AI uses structured data to understand your content. If you're not using schema markup, you're invisible to AI. Site speed is critical. The AI doesn't have time to wait for slow sites to load. If your site takes more than three seconds to load, you're out of the game. Mobile optimization is non-negotiable. Most AI searches happen on mobile devices. If your site isn't mobile friendly, you won't get cited. Internal linking structure matters more than backlinks now. The AI follows internal links to understand the relationship between your content pieces. A strong internal linking structure helps the AI understand your expertise across topics. But here's the biggest change of all. The AI doesn't just look at your content once and forget about it. It continuously monitors your content for updates, improvements, and new information. This means content maintenance is now more important than content creation. Updating your existing articles with new information, fresh data, and current examples is often more valuable than writing new articles. The AI also tracks user engagement with your content. If people quickly bounce from your site, the AI notices. If people spend time reading and engaging, the AI notices that too. This is why user experience is now a ranking factor. It's not just about having good content. It's about presenting that content in a way that keeps people engaged. Now, let me share some patterns I'm seeing with sites that are winning with AI mode. Sites that focus on being incredibly thorough with their data sourcing and citation are getting more AI citations. They didn't increase their content volume. They just became more reliable sources. Local businesses that started publishing detailed case studies of their work are showing up in AI mode for their industry. They went from ranking on page three to being cited in AI answers on page one. But here's what's coming next that nobody's prepared for. A Google is already testing ads inside AI mode. That means paid search and organic search are about to merge in ways we've never seen before. Businesses that master AI mode optimization are gonna have a massive competitive advantage. They're going to be the trusted sources that AI systems rely on. They're going to get the highest quality traffic and they're going to dominate their industries, but you have to start now. The window of opportunity won't stay open forever. The data is clear. ChatGPT saw a 44% traffic boost in November 2024 and Perplexity reached 15 million monthly users in late 2024. People are changing how they search for information and Google is adapting with AI mode. The question isn't whether this change is happening, it's whether you're going to 
adapt, or get left behind. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below and let me know what questions you have about AI mode and how it's affecting your website traffic. If you want the exact AI SEO playbook, we used to grow from zero to 145,000 monthly visitors and scale past eight figures, you need to check out SEO Elite Circle. This is where I share the secret strategies that made us millions. You get weekly hot seat calls where I solve your biggest roadblocks live, direct access to me where you can DM me and I'll help you personally, live weekly calls that are recorded too, you get actionable strategies you can steal right away. I save you hundreds of hours with weekly action plans. Plus you get my private case studies with my secret SEO strategies and my swipe and deploy SOPs to make SEO easy. There's only 21 spots left before prices go up at 450 members. Link is in the comments and description. And if you need help with your SEO strategy in this new AI world, I'm offering free SEO strategy sessions. The link is in the comments and description below. The future of SEO is here and it's powered by AI. Don't get left behind.